What is a triangle? A triangle is a shape in geometry made up of three sides which are line segments that meet at three corners or vertices, producing three internal angles. As with angles, triangles can be classified by the types of angles they have. A triangle in which each of the internal angles is less than 90 degrees is an acute triangle. A triangle that has one angle greater than 90 degrees is an obtuse triangle. And a triangle with one internal angle equal to 90 degrees is a right angle triangle. A triangle that doesn't have a 90 degree internal angle is an oblique triangle. An equilateral triangle has three sides that are equal in length and internal angles that all equal 60 degrees. An isosceles triangle has two sides that are equal in length and two equal angles opposite the two equal sides. And in a scalene triangle, the sides are all different in length and the internal angles are all different. However, no matter what individual internal angles go to make up a triangle, the three internal angles of a triangle always add up to a total of 180 degrees. So if you know two of the angles in a triangle, you can always work out the third. In this example, angle A is 50 degrees, and angle B is 45 degrees. So angle C equals 180 minus 95, or 85 degrees. Also, if you know the length of the base of any triangle, and you know its height, you can determine the area, which is equal to one half the base multiplied by the height. In this example, the base measures 2 units in length, and the height is 3 units in length. So the area enclosed by the triangle is 1 half 2 times 3, or 3 square units. Finally, right angle triangles are special in that they obey the Pythagorean theorem. In a right angle triangle, the side opposite the right angle is called the hypotenuse, and the other two sides are called the legs. The Pythagorean theorem states that in a right angle triangle, the sum of the squares of the two legs is equal to the square of the hypotenuse. So if you know the length of the legs, you can work out the length of the hypotenuse. In this example, one leg is 3 units long, and the other leg is 4 units long. So the hypotenuse equals the square root of 3 squared plus 4 squared, or the square root of 25, which is 5.